What up? What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy Jess, and today we are in week eight of our franchise after a amazing victory over the Texans. Today our playbook is Jimmy Johnson. Jimmy, jo why do I keep landing on these names? Why do I continue to land on these names of playbooks? Why can't I get a playbook that is, you know, used today instead of 1985? Like, why I got to get these old playbooks, man? The Colts, they decided to go back with Peyton Manning, man. They got Peyton Manning over there. And, uh, yeah, he's going to be a handful. He takes forever to snipe the ball because he's always making these damn adjustments and it's frustrating as we're going to go on ahead and take a look at their offensive uh, players. So, after that beautiful victory, we're feeling good, man. We're feeling like we have an opportunity to go on ahead and hopefully be able to do good and win this game. Because the last game, defensively, we forced like three turnovers. Look at, really? Really? Peyton Manning, the read option, Peyton? Peyton Manning snuck me with the read option. Third and two. We don't allow the first down, which is huge. So, that right there was big. Let's see if we can go on ahead and hopefully be able to score, take advantage of that because we don't stop the computer on all Madden too often. So hopefully we can go on ahead and provide ourselves with a, uh, a score here, take the lead. We get ball at halftime, so we would be up one possession as we take a look at Derek Carr's stats for the season. Right here, we roll out, though, on the run. Good pass to Cooper. Not much, but better than that sack that uh, we were looking at. So, uh, again, we want to get it moving offensively. I'm taking a look at the playbook. I think they only have, like, one offensive formation, maybe even two for shotgun. And I love shotgun. I need my shotgun, and they just don't have anything I prefer. The running formations are stuff I really don't like too too much. So uh, right here we just roll out, not much. And I didn't think Kerrigan would snag that. And why is he six twelve? Look how tall he is. That man could tie his shoes, not bending down, like just standing up. He could tie his shoes. Like look how tall he. Of course, Ahmad Bradshaw's breaking tackles left and right. Uh, we actually get ourselves a nice stop in the backfield. Peyton Manning breaks the B gap, of course. Finds somebody wide open towards the left. Because that's what happens on all Madden. Bro broken tackles left and right. It's so frustrating, man. It, it really is. They hit the flats. And again, we get another stop. Nothing myself. Too wow. A fake punt, though? A fake punt. Yo, these all Madden bastards with their fake punts, man. Right here, I try like an off tackle. I don't know what the hell that is. I don't know. I'm just trying plays. Because I don't know what the hell to run out of Jamie Johnson playbook. And we lose 97 yards right there. And... That right there may be tough for us to bounce back and pick up the first down as we take a look at their defensive personnel. And, uh, yeah, we got two stops, but they're doing pretty well on defense themselves. We're not looking too good offensively. Right here, we back up second 18, and they send like a freaking dual A-gap. <laughs> right here, I step up, block, shed, sack, and it's just like, wow, I can't get no time. I'm struggling over here, fellas, struggling. Right here, punt, of course, we try to bounce it, and, of course, it bounces right to him, right? So, again, defensively, uh, we send the B gap. You see it came through, but he got rid of the ball before he got sacked. Uh, right there, right again, before he gets sacked, he gets the ball off. Third and inches, we stop him. So, three consecutive uh, possessions, we get three stops. All we need to do is score. But I, I just can't. I'm struggling over here with this damn playbook. So, right here, second. But that's what makes this franchise fun. You know, right there, if you rewind that, the running back was so wide open out of the backfield. But my problem was, I, uh, as we throw interception right there, I was hitting RB. Nine times out of ten, the running back um, icon is uh, uh, RB. And right there, I don't know what happened. Missed the assignment right there. And then he hits me with the Dion. I was so mad. Um, it was RB. So I'm hitting RB. And then I realized his icon was Y. And I was like, oh, my goodness. I didn't even realize that. He was so wide open, too. Uh, right here, again, they're freaking block shedding, sending blitzes at me, coming through untouched right here. Oh, we do a nice slant, and we get a huge opening, and Santana Moss scores the touchdown, tying the game. That right there was astronomically biblical. That right there was a huge score, being able to go on ahead and tie the game. So uh, let's see if we could, again, defensively get ourselves to stop. We've been doing well all game besides that missed assignment over there last uh, drive. Again, they hit us towards the flats. And, yeah, we're missing tackles. And that's because I, I try to go. I try to hit uh, A to see if I could uh, get a suction tackle. And, nope, I just fall over and miss. And Peyton Manning steps up in the pocket. And, whew, thankfully, he dropped that right there. So, right here, Peyton Manning goes towards the flat again and uh, picks up a couple yards. So, right here on third and six, goes over towards the left. And we don't allow them to get the first down, which was big. They end up settling for a field goal. 
uh, would have been nice if we prevented that. But again, you know, after that huge play where he picked up a 75 yard uh, gain after a, a two yard hitch route, um, we held him to a field goal, which I, I guess is not too bad. So right here we roll out and we got somebody open. Just miscommunication right there. So right here we back up with Carr and just throw it out of bounds, man. The pressure was there. Couldn't find nobody open. We go underneath. We can't get the first down. And, of course, they call a timeout to try and get the ball back. Right here, we punt the ball. It'll skip right to out of bounds. So, with 17 seconds remaining, they are just going to go on ahead and try to get in field goal range. But, thankfully, we get a sack right there. And from here, they're just going to run the ball out so we can go on ahead and head into overtime. I mean, excuse me, halftime. And uh, that's exactly what it is we do. So, we receive ball. We're down 10-7. to 7. Our defense is playing really well. You know, there are times where I can't stop the computer whatsoever. This game, I'm, I'm actually getting stops. But we're unable, look at this nonsense, man. Like, come on. But we're unable to go on ahead and get ourselves any scores and take advantage of it. Right there, whoo. Thankfully, we pick up the first down. That right there was huge. Right, we go to the run. And again, I'm struggling to find plays that I prefer, I like. Right here, we go to the screenplay. And we pick up the first down. And we're getting our way closer and closer to field goal range. Right here, a little off tackle. Nice juke towards the inside. Definitely got ourselves a nice gain. Second and five, we end up going to the drag route, the Cooper, uh, you know, just doing anything underneath, trying to keep the ball moving. Right here, RB open again, and I couldn't get the double juke off. That dang true step ended up catching me where I couldn't get the ball off. Right here, out of the backfield, we pick up the first down. So we're in perfect territory to go ahead and hopefully score. We go back to the screen, and nice spin move. And right now, we are looking at second and four. Try to run the ball, and we go absolutely nowhere. So on third and five, we're looking for a first down. Again, Y is wide open. I'm hitting RB, but the icon is Y, and it's messing me up right here. I miss the field goal. I paid no attention to the wind. It's a bamboo, and we don't recover. I paid no attention to the wind. That was like, I think it was like 13 miles an hour. I didn't look. I had no idea. I kicked the field goal, and I missed the opportunity of tying the game. Uh, it, it's my fault. Can't blame nobody but me. I just did not look at the wind. I didn't think it would be that strong. And the wind just demolished the, the, the ball all the way towards the right. Uh, right here, we end up passing to Steve Smith. So here we go, man. Two-minute warning. And uh, we got to try and advance the ball, man. And wide open drag. Wide open drag. Wide open drag. Of course, right? Wide open drag. And we don't hit the throw. Carr completely misses the drag. And he throws it in the dirt. And now we're down 10. Uh, and, and our defense played spectacular. Our defense put us in a position to win. And our offense just isn't coming through. And if we're going to come back, we need a lot of things to go. Just dropped right there. Third and 10. We pick up the first down. Now, of course, we're no huddling. We're, we, it's in frantic mode. We need to go on ahead and drop pass. We need to go on ahead and make something happen right here. We try to go deep, and Carr overthrows him. Oh, we try to go for a play action, and we end up not getting anything. So 17-7, to 7, we drop the first down opportunity right there. And right here, there's no sense in uh, calling timeouts, man. We'll just admit defeat. Game is over. So we end up losing, even though our defense played great. Our offense could not get anything going. So that's the end of the game, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. It's your boy, GS. We can't get on a winning streak to save our lives. We're going to be signing out. Peace!